So I think it's in our interest, if we want to save journalism, to at least keep newspapers alive, even though they shouldn't be the only way we have journalism in the future. But I would raise this to another level, which is it's about the issue we're facing now is how do you compensate and incent creative production in the digital realm? In other words, whatever it is somebody's creating digitally, whether it's journalism or videos or music or books or video games or blogs or citizen journalism, it is very hard in the digital realm to have user-generated revenue for those things. So what you have is an entire realm from YouTube to Facebook to the Times-Picayune and the New York Times as newspapers and all sorts of people creating applets and games and all sorts of wonderful creative products in the digital realm who are totally dependent on advertising revenue for their support. This is not, as the senator said, a great business model. You don't want to be totally dependent on government. You don't want to be totally dependent probably on anything. You certainly don't want to be totally dependent only on advertising to say this is how we will pay people who create things that are digital.